This unit will be able to help any healthcare professionals reuse their N95 masks up to 45 times. Brent Habitler created what could be a beneficial machine during the COVID-19 pandemic. With some help from A-plus machining here in Lloydminster, he created a mass sterilization unit that uses hydrogen peroxide vapors to sterilize up to 24 M95 masks at a time for up to 45 uses. Uh, hydrogen peroxide, the way it works, it, it, it will kill proteins. If you saturate it properly enough, all these proteins are what the viruses and germs attach to. So if you kill all the proteins on a mask, you've killed all the germs and all the viruses. Our unit here, this is where our peroxide vapor comes out of. It fills the chamber completely and saturates in within a predetermined timeline. Then it has a, a rest period where it continues to saturate and into the mask. And then the, there's another unit that'll evacuate with a fan all of the chemical and put it, any residual back into the actual unit inside to recycle it. In the back housing, we have timers, set delays, and we have a holding tank inside that can hold enough product to do 200 cycles with this unit. It takes 10 minutes to run through its complete cycle to do 24 masks. Through self-funding and discussions with the federal government during the testing process, Brent hopes that federal funding can help go from building 10 units per week to up to 50 units per week. I plan on taking it to a few of the clinics that are interested in it and uh, even a few of the private uh, companies around Lloyd Minister that want to continue to use the masks for their staff. They can't purchase any more masks. They want to use the same type of unit. Habitler has a patent pending on his machine and if all goes according to plan, these units should be in hospitals within a month. Connor Chan, Primetime Local News.